So that's uh, your Dylan update. And regardless of who you think is more disgusted by whom, all of you will be disgusted by Pamper Chew. Uh, sorry if you've already been spoiled by this feature, but if you don't know, because this is someone I've almost never talked about on stream, years and years ago, there was a guy who went online. He was famous in the furry community because he would microwave used diapers. He would literally steal diapers out of the trash and microwave them to make them warm and then wear them. I think he got cancer. Unfortunately, medical science was able to prevail and cured him of his cancer for reasons unknown to everybody. And now he spends his days playing on very old computers and video game consoles. I don't think he's a developer. I think he just likes to play on like the Amiga and he collects silver coins. And I've repeatedly tried to get him to relinquish his silver coins to me, but he refuses because he is evil. He's a monster. And for some reason out of absolutely nowhere, uh, Pamper Chew decides to join what uh, our telegram chat our telegram chat which is known as the um junta or junta controlled government of the kiwi farms extraterrestrial telegram occupied zone it is not technically moderated by anyone related to the kiwi farms however it exists and, and is moderated completely on its own by complete random people that i don't know anything about because i need it in case the site goes down it's kind of like Taiwan. It's his own thing, but we can retreat there if we need to. Um, so this, he, ju he jumps into the Kiwi Farms uh, uh, autonomous region in, in Telegram, and he starts voice chatting with people there. He posts this picture at their direction, and this is important. They ask him to post a picture of himself wearing a pant turban, and he yields this photo to prove that he is, in fact, um, the pamper chew that he claims to be. And I, I, I specify this because when I start playing these clips, you're going to think that it's AI, especially this first clip. Like just, I mean, this is going to make you angry. It doesn't matter who you are. Uh, these clips are pretty infuriating. I hate monkeys and I want to kill an animal. Well, I don't know if you guys are the Gorg people, but, uh, uh someone's going to come over here. Oh, hopefully we can take apart an animal together. I'll keep it clean. I don't. I don't care if it gets on the carpet or the walls. So you might listen to that and think we are in the the nightmare world of machine learning. So clearly this could be a fake. Um, however, this clip seals it for me that he's not. It's not a fake. This this is him and his boyfriend talking because uh, he is gay, uh, talking on voice chat. And this is two people talking. It's done in real time. There are multiple witnesses to this and they overlap with each other. And also the machine learning does a very poor job with autism voice. People have tried to reckon, like re recreate the way that I speak with machine learning tools and it doesn't work. There's something about how I sound, the vocal fry, the, the stutter that I do, the weird cadence that I have. It doesn't, if you try to, if you try to recreate me in machine learning with the current technology, it just sounds too clean. It doesn't have my, the weird speech impediments that I have. And that's the same thing with uh, Pamper Chew. It can't recreate him. So this is the clip that kind of says like, oh, this is a bit strange. <laughs> I can't remember the rest of it. That's my caretaker or my boyfriend. So he's trying to sing the, the national anthem, but he couldn't remember it. And then his boyfriend cracks up in the background. It's like, okay, so that's like a real recording. This isn't like machine learning. And it's just crazy because it's like the shit he says. It's like, how, how the fuck? Do you have the audacity to do this? <clears throat> um. And also, I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat it. I'm not, I'm not just gonna take it apart and fuck it. I, no, we're gonna. I want, I, I want to learn. I have never done it before, but I really like that stuff. And then I'll probably cook the meat and eat it for dinner. So we're gonna eat. We're gonna have dinner together. Rape sucks, but I like children. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm not a bad pedophile. I just like children. I mean, I like to cuddle up with them or, you know, hang out with them and do stuff, you know, feed them, things like that. I'm not like a raper or anything. No, I would never fuck kids, but at best, I might jack them off if they wanted. 
to do it with me. I mean, they can do it themselves, or we can do it side by side, you know? I'll show them the fursuit head and stuff. But no, 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 I'm not going to be mean. I, won't, I mean, or that's not mean. But I won't do anything inappropriate. That's what I should say. What I mean is I don't want to stick it in. I can just play with their feet if they if they don't mind. But uh, <laughs> they have that on Telegram, too. You can look at kids' feet all the time. Yeah, the pool at the park here. That's where I met him. Oh, he was, he was, well, he liked me so much. He was showing me his feet, and then he went and went into the bathroom and jacked off. But I don't need to talk about that. No, I haven't microwaved a diaper in a minute. I got a diaper, nigga. I got, I got, I bought $4,000 for the diapers. My closet is full. I wear them, I've been wearing them since I was 14. I threw out my underwear when I was 14. So, uh, just to reiterate, the monkey torture people are pedophiles. ABDL is pedophilia. And, like, he's never talked about He's just, like, fucked up. He's now with, like, a gay boyfriend. They're probably both, um, you know, uh, they're probably both into it together. I'm sure they are. How, like, how else do you stick around with someone that much? So, like, he's just all the things. He's, he's gay. He's in diapers. He's a furry. He's into kids, and he wants to kill animals. It's, it's like, yeah, I'm sure that, like, to me, like, that degeneracy kind of melds together. Uh, I really don't, I think that if you allowed someone like Dylan Mulvaney to fully exploit their their desires and just have, like, total control with no fear, they would they would eventually get to this point pretty quickly. Um... That's why I just don't like them. I don't like any of them. Uh, I've become less tolerant over time as I've become more exposed to them. It's like, yeah, I see how the, the, the vein goes. Like how the, the people just become sicker over time. Apparently he got sh showed up by law enforcement at some point. I don't even know what for. Um, I guess he got reported for CP or something, but the police come to his house. Oh, no. I'm a good person. I, I like kids. Don't worry about it. I'm always the, the police showed up twice in this year last year, so no, 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 everything's fine. The first time they want to see if there's any like kids in the house to make sure everything was fine, and they just talked to me and they gave me their card. The second time, same thing. I like I said something on Telegram. They showed up, so yeah, you gotta watch what you say online. But uh, I must have said something where they were like concerned. But no, everything is fine. I don't remember, but the, the police officer had, like, paperwork that had, like, the, the transcript. And he, he had something circled in, in something about being a pedophile and said, yeah, yeah, I am. But, no, since I, since I, don't, I don't do anything wrong, you can say whatever you want. But they did show up. But everything's fine. Also, I'm kind of famous, so that's why people would call the police. You know, it's happened twice, so... Um, that's not normal. If you're not famous, you probably won't have it happen. Just, but be, always be a good person and don't hurt children. No, um, they just came in and asked if there's, you know, any problems. And they said, can I look at your phone? And I just bought a new phone. I said, no. And he said, he said, I thank you for that. Okay, so just, just in case we're all not clear. All right. Um, in case you need to be reminded... Posting on 4chan about about shooting somebody over a political disagreement, bad. Hate speech, bad. Also known as Haas postings in Europe. This... I hate monkeys, and I want to kill an animal. Well, I don't know if you guys are the Gorg people, but... Uh, uh, someone's going to come over here, hopefully, and we can take apart an animal together. I'll keep it clean. I don't. I don't care if it gets on the carpet or the walls. That's okay. As long as you remember the difference, chat. This is where our political alignments are today. This is where our law and order is all set up. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, that's that. Now we'll have a a palate cleanser. We'll get to the good stuff to wash down all this misery. Here's a picture of Chantal. Thank you for watching this clip. This is the CACA Lofa. Remember to like and subscribe.